need our ADC to actually play aggressive with us. If our AD carry doesn't actually play aggressive, then Hob feels like shit. In general, Airy feels better because it's um less dependent on your laning phase. But Hob feels better than Comet. A hundred percent because you can win lane very hard with uh Hob compared to Comet, where you just kinda win lane with Comet. And Red Tree feels really good on Jenna for early game. But Aerie is just a lot more consistent and you don't have to like turbo force in laning phase. And the problem with taking Hob, especially on NA server, um, Castle is your AD carry, they never play aggressive. They just play to farm. It's the most tilting thing ever. AD carry matchup is always 50... 50-50. This server. So if I take a rune to try to win laning phase, my AD carry doesn't actually play aggressive or play with my... Oh. One. Okay, well, that's fine now. Oh. I don't know why I tried to make her blow flash or like predict the flash blow, but I still catch her, right? What the fuck? That's interesting. Okay, hob gap, hob gap. <laughs> To be fair, we probably win that without Hob, but makes it easier. I don't think I reset here. I want to get the someone to get XP in our lane. What? Question mark ping doesn't do it? Oh my god, he cancelled auto. Troll. Rune gap, uh, yeah, 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 definitely not. We have better champion. Must be rune. Oh, I fucking grief my Halo Blade there. I want to trade really hard on my three here. I uh, probably shouldn't take that cannon XP. Maybe the needs to catch up in XP, so. Oh, he dodged that. Okay, that's fine. I want to reset here anyway. I don't have Q. I want to reset because I have a. Swifty reset. How do I have four zombies? Wait, what? I only dropped one ward, no? But how does this work? Is it telling me I have two AP or four AP? Yeah, okay, never mind. It's telling me the AP number. Uh, did you skill Q? Uh, kinda, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That was a very situational, you're correct, yes. I don't know how I'm doing this. No, I rope. But usually I'd go Q if I'm taking trade against support and like even lane state. It's just there I really wanted uh, to not touch the wave. What the fuck? Are there junglers here? Oh fuck. We don't get anything here. We can't kill him. Wait, can we? Oh fuck, there's a vein here. Oh my god, I'm the fucking goat! <laughs> AD Janna, sup Zeri. Lax. Can I go one more? I have 100 HP, but it's okay. It's not okay. Not okay. Not okay. Hmm. The fuck? Okay, fuck it. I do these. I win these. I win these.
All right, you win these, you win these. Oh! Oh, oh sup, Chai? Oh, no. Ah, uh, whatever. We don't talk about it. Bro. The fuck is he there for? <laughs> Darius caught up in XP? I would hope so. Oh my god. Oh my lord. Hmm. <laughs> zero three zero. Hmm. One more kill? Fuck it. Am I supposed to go mid here and help him? I don't know. I'm just gonna hit a tower. Enjoyable. What? Wait, what? I fucked the vein, dude. She fucking walked into my queue. That's Zaki? Yeah, it is Zack. A big timer here. Uh oh. Top cap? Sure, sure. Oh, my Korean's so bad. Can I just flash on him? <laughs> Don't think much is going on here. Oh yeah, so it's about to, uh, Yoni's about, um... Sick. Alright, I think of the YouTube video now. My Halo Bleeds Jenna makes enemy team AFK. Oh my gosh, my Yone actually getting solo killed? No way I rally is this OP champion. Come on, come on, come on. I solo killed him, don't worry. Okay, well, that one's not having fun. <laughs> Wait, where'd the soda go? <laughs> Wait, come back. She's getting deep vision. What the fuck am I supposed to do? I'm gapped. An enemy has been slain. Play Hob, full lady Jenna and Arena? Maybe. I mean, Pekka did that. It didn't even look that interesting. Is that first order or which one? Oh, Zach is looking. Where do you see Subcap? Oh my god, I'm so talented. But you need reset. You're in my the fuck my bot. Dude, I am rusty. Okay, that guy's not stepping up. Oh, it's like the healing one. Sort of blessing him done. <laughs> Bro, I'm telling you, nobody hits more Janna keys snipes than I do. This is missing, but it's fine.
Oh fucking scorch man. Sure, sure, sure. <laughs> Do not try this at home. But that one YouTube commenter want? True. What if I just don't upload it to YouTube? Then what are they gonna do? Checkmate. Cool. Yay, 10 stacks. Now I'm OP. Do 10 stacks? 10 stack Jenna? Feels so good because of the moon speed buff. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I missed. <laughs> Can I come back? Okay, I land this one. Don't worry. <laughs> Bro, she moved. She moved. I didn't think she was going to move. Look how smart I am. Now I can reset and I have extra stacks. Sup, Cap? And I move faster. Alright. I know what I actually do. I just play Janna for five games straight. I get back to Challenger playing Janna. And I upload all of them back to back to back. In one video. What the fuck? Hey! Don't you fucking kill her without me. But I moved his jungle pet faster, but I didn't move him faster. <laughs> Yay! Plus four stacks. Thank you for my AP, buddy. If you guys are enjoying, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate it a lot. Um, all right, good sell out, good sell out. Oh my god. My Zeri's fucking in there. Yeah, I probably could have blocked that if I went for it. My bad. I landed that Q. Cool. Wait, can't I just dive this guy? Hold on. I don't think this uh, tornado's landing. Okay, you're just bad. I don't know what to say. Wait, I don't have ward! Oh my fucking god, I griefed that so badly. Okay, my farm now. Number one tip when you're playing support. Bait your laners so that you can take their farm. And their tower. An enemy has been slain. Oh my god, I guess I'll just take this wave, guys. The tempest is upon you. Wink. Fuck. Who is it? Is it Jace? Nice try, buddy. ED Jenna? Okay, ED Jenna. JK, JK. Want more movement speed. What? Thank you. Never mind, BF, 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 BF. Okay, good. ED Jenna, ED Jenna.
Oh my god, I'm smurfing. <laughs> Uh oh, we want to invade. I already started W. That's awkward. Q is better on invades usually. But our team runs faster, so that's nice. All right. Well, hopefully we're not walking into a stack anywhere. I don't think we have to do too much to get a lot from her. I shouldn't have fucking exhausted there, actually. That's kind of disappointing. If we can stop her reset, though, over and over again, it's really fucking insane for us. Nice. All right, bought, bought a super one now. Anyway, uh, I'll just talk about the reads because I'll probably upload this to a video as well, or longer into the video. Let's burn one. The fuck does that mean? Uh oh, does he want to pull wave? Kick it. Um, I would area this game because my laning strength isn't really that important. This matchup is very dead. All I want to do is match the Alistar's roams, and area is a better scaling rune for that. Um, you still take celerity and relentless hunter, so you can move around the map pretty fast. But area overall, like I said, it just scales a lot better. I'm not gonna hit this guy. Unless he goes for XP. But I don't want to pull the minion aggro of the range creeps until most of the melees are dead. Or else we're going to over push the wave. And we're not going to deny as much as we want from the Jinx. So when I'm taking my trades, I'm taking them from down here as to not take any aggro from the creeps. Or like half the aggro. Because like it's a really common strat when you play Alistar to just like lift the enemy bot lane and hit you so that they over push the wave and they crash on two and it allows you to stabilize on three a lot easier. Um, whereas instead we want to crash on three, right? Wait, this guy's fucking trolling. I can't believe he just walked down his entire lane when Jed is charging Tornado. That's actually illegal. Oh, I missed my auto attack there. Oh, I need to not use my Q like that anymore. I forgot. Did, when they, uh, did they revert to Janna? Oh, what the fuck? Am I dead? No, I'm chilling. When they did the revert to Janna, uh, they made her Q mana cost really high. Oh, no. Damn, that sucks. It's no longer a dive. It's just a reset. It's fine. This lane is still going really well for us. We have a lot of spell thief stacks already. I have to stay in case he E's in there and Alistar can hex flash on him or something. Oh fuck. Can you out? My reset got really delayed here. Now Alistar is Alistar has massive roam timer. I cancel. Get my refillable here. Fuck it. Since so I'm playing versus Alicopter, I need to make sure my pings are on point this game, and I'm actually tracking him well. Because he's one of the sports that actually just turbo roams, and I fucking hate playing versus him because of it. Because I just want to play the game, lay in, have a nice time, and chill. But if he's trying, he's literally everywhere on the fucking map, and it's so annoying. This guy... 
the fuck? I don't have anything here, it kind of sucks. I was just going for a 1v1. Honestly, I would have rather just gone bot from this. Maybe he'll W me and go on me or something? I don't know. I just wish I would bot there. Then kind of thanks for the prime, bro. Hope you've been well. Who's in Kuda? Uh, pretty sure Alistar is coming ball, no? I mean, is he? Super play, top. That's the GG. Actual super play top. Guys have been well. Also, I'm going, uh, it, it, ah, going Lucidity Boots. This game. Because I don't care about the Swifties anymore, the damage, because I'm not playing Halo Blades. What a fucking play from my Fiora. I wish I got to see what happened. Maybe I'll go look in the replay. Cause he fucking smurfed that. Realistically, I want to be bot catching this XP and stuff like that. But I just can't trust where this Alistar is. So I just stay. She's no ghost. What a fucking tornado. Oh, fuck. Nice. Good room. We take a reset here. Drop our support item before we reset because it should upgrade in 3, 2, 1. Buy Dark Seal because we're ahead in the game. And I, a greedy bastard. Team is smurfing. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this chap's broken. I don't know, man. Every single time I lock this shit in, we just win. Yeah, I'll start going bots, so I'll just match. I haven't really done anything this game, but free LP. And we just punish the Jinx when we could, punish the Jinx. Oops. Getting fucking kited by this Jinx pretty hard. Pretty sure Alistar is in the bush behind her. I don't really want to take this trade. I just want to stay in XP range. The reason I didn't want to take the trade is because I didn't have a... My shield up. Fuck, dude. Okay. Pretty sure there's an Alistar in that bush, but I'm not 100% sure. Okay, yeah, there is. So good for us. I don't have a Q up here, so I want to be a little careful about how I approach the Alistar. Uh, trading. Good juking. Probably gonna go three points W into Emax this game because I have area. Although I really like the extra movement speed that you get from W. I guess it's only 1%. That's probably just fake. I wanna just get vision of this guy if I can. I don't need to trade so aggressively anymore. I care about that because I already have my sidestone. I just don't want to add too much volatility to our lane while our jungler's on top side and our top side's already winning. Like, one thing people don't do enough in solo queue is, like, I've already accepted as, like, the character that I am and the lane, the the state of the game that all I have to do now is not run it down and match Alistar Roams, and we will win the game. So if I'm just, like, trading mindlessly in my lane, like, looking for aggressive plays and stuff like that, it's not good anymore. It's not worth it. If anything fucks up and makes the game uh, more volatile than it needs to be, we're just trolling.
So there's no point for us to actually take the... Uh, oh, I'm trolling, see? Oh, I didn't get my shield off. But I, I thought I had my team to actually cover this timer, so it didn't seem that bad. Yeah, we did. Seems okay, the result now, because we're going to kill Jinx as well. We're getting two kills for them going on me like that. I don't really mind. An enemy has been slain. It was an okay play from them as well. We just uh, clear the wave here as much as we can. Try to prevent this guy from getting too many plates or too much damage to our mid tower. Look at this guy, so no. Do you actually want to look on Obsidian? Nice. I think I said, I think we just look on that guy. He's better. I don't think we're doing anything. E. Let me just fuck with him for fun. When Fiora comes, though, we can probably look. Yeah, we kill him now. We have ulti here, so we can push him towards our team. Oh no. Good. So we need to protect our Ezreal on this wave now. No, no, no. Wait. Pretty sure our jungler is supposed to shift down. I take mid wave again, and he just helps our AD carry catch ball. You should fight this guy if you have something. We need to run ball. Hmm. Or at least I played this poorly. He's supposed to cover bot. I'm supposed to cover mid. For the top play. Because I took his role in the top play. He needs to take my role in the bot play. And I'll take his play on the mid play. You know what I mean? You have to make sure you're always covering stuff when you're making plays. Because they're always going to look to make a play on the other side of the map. Especially in like higher elos. So I show top, but it's a signal to the Alistar, hey, the enemy support isn't here, I will just dive. And a lot of people will just be able to get that off. But if you're like a good jungler or a good support player, you understand like where you need to shift to cover the opponent's or like your teammate's position. So I ran top to get a kill as like the jungler. I'm ganking for him. And now he needs to be the support because I was the jungler. And then I will be the mid laner because the mid laner will shift to top and need a reset. If that makes sense. I don't know where Alistar is. Oh, I found Alistar. I'm just gonna ult here. Pretty sure I die though. If Jinx has ulti. Ugh. Eddie Carry's kind of trolling me. That's fine. That's a classic helicopter play. Yeah, it doesn't really matter too much. Our champs scale so well into their champs that we shouldn't have to chill. Yeah. It's how you actually build advantages in League, what I'm talking about. Because if you make a play top and they just get a counter play bots because you made a play top, you're not up gold, right? You're just even, you're just trading. I should have been going to the stun play. I don't know why that play is happening, but I should have been going to it. Never mind, my team's fucking goaded. Yes, there's zero six zero. Why well, I just set a vision on bot side because I want to play for this tower. That's why I was just playing the bot. My jungler at. There's a jinx here. Sure. Do I need to flash this wall? Godlike. 
I'm waiting for my Lisa to actually do something, and I want to ult off it, but that's fine. Should I put your boards back into E? Could have flashed there, honestly. Probably worth it in that situation. Alright, well, GG. Alright, well, there's my challenger, LP. Just two quick games of Janna abuse for a challenger back. Sounds good. <coughs> Should be at least. Eight seventy four. According to Deep Lol, there's currently Challenger LP. I think. I'll double check. This is eight sixty nine. Sure, we'll just uh, set it for the day or whatever.